Good morning, Dot Sizzle Nation. What's up? We're out of Stewart today, and uh, it's a little bit of a south current close to shore at least. And south so current's bad, it's usually north. Yeah, it's supposed to be north, so had a little trouble finding bait. You gotta run around quite a bit, but we seem to be on some now. But So, so uh, we'll see how it oh, goes. Oh, I just lost a couple. Catch them on two at a time. We're gonna get offshore and catch a big fish. Follow us out there. Boat. All right, guys. Had a little trouble finding some fish out here, but we're on a uh, it's on a drift right now. Darcy is uh, getting her line set back up after losing on the bottom, and uh, see what this is. Maybe Benita. Yes, yeah, somebody mentioned in the last video that this reel doesn't sound good, and I agree. That reel sounds this awesome. This reel is not sounding very good, that guys. Perfect. It needs to get worked on. That's no. definitely the gears. Perfectly fine. Everybody said this was stripped last time. It's not stripped. You hear it? No. All I hear is magic. We oh, got I... a kingfish? There's not no kingfish. Let me Look see. at him. He just smoked to the side. That's a big old kingfish. Yeah? Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Follow your fish. Should I get the gaff out, you think? Should yeah. I get the gaff out? Unless you want to release him. You got a kingfish. Let him go. No, we're gonna keep him. Circle doing his job. All right, bring him over here. Hang Here on. we go. Let me do a circle. Let me do a circle. Good job. <laughs> Get him in the boat. Good job. Nice. Broke off the skunk. Only took about five hours. That's Woo. why it's called fishing. Nice. It's a nice custom gaff from, uh, where we get this gaff? X Generation. Very popular spot down in Lantana. Yeah, circle hook. For all your offshore needs. Circle hook perfectly in the corner. See that circle hook, guys, if you use a J hook, that fish will swallow that and uh, you cut your line off. So the circle hook caught us the fish that time. A little bloody. Little bloody. All right, I gotta get rigged. A little rigged. bloody, no big deal. I gotta get rigged. All right, get rigged up. I'll, I guess I gotta clean up that mess. Yeah. Another one on. Putting got his lines tangled. You can get that on wrap real quick. I see this one wrap. Get ready. You get ready. Get ready. Get it a little short? Yeah. It's an Atlantic. Sharp Spotted nose. Sharp nose. Wanna eat him? No. Okay. He broke off. Yay, took my hook again. Took your hook. Awesome. I don't like seeing those sharks. When I hook those sharks, it usually means that the other good bottom fish, like the grouper and the snapper, are kind of on the down low, and those guys are on the hunt. Yeah, usually catching sharks is not great. There's some structure right here, though. Watch this hook. It's a snapper. Nice, hey. short mutton. Nice, he's anchored up. You little sucker. Nice. Little short mutton in the boat. Nice. I'll take it. All right, guys, we decided to anchor up. Our buddy Sultan Dave was catching some fish and he gave us some good intel, so keep your friends out here. And don't just caught a short mutton, so not too shabby, and hopefully we'll get a bigger one. Yeah. See you then. Let's go, yeah, Sizzle. I think he's gone. Oh, well, not get him. Ooh. Nice, Sizzle. Get that Ooh. fish up. Whoa. Line. You gotta get up here, buddy. You gotta get up here. Come on. Let's see, Sizzle. I'm trying, Brian. I know. <laughs> Anything could go wrong right now. Big shark. I see no shark. He just bit him. See a shark? Yeah. It looks like a keeper. Woo! It's gonna be close. You're gonna be very, very close. Let's All right, see. nice job. Nice, I'll take it. So this particular area we're at, we're actually looking for mangrove snappers, because uh, that's what our buddy was catching here earlier. But you know what, a mutton snapper, a keeper, I'll take that all day. Yeah, Darcy loves that. Got the official Darcy the ruler. Yes. It's gotta be 18 inches. Yep. 
And he's gonna make it. Almost 19. He's a keeper. Awesome. Get over here. Now yeah. we got him. That was a weird bite. It might be a remora or a shark playing with it. It doesn't feel like a snapper, that's for sure. What we got? Big remora. Shark. No, a little shark. Darn, it's a shark day, man. Shark day for sure. Bring him in, I'll get my hook. Hold on, I got my hook. I'm right here. What'd you say? Let me know when you're ready. Yeah, go ahead. Got him? I got him. There we go. Another one. Slaying Atlantic sharp nose. Killing it. Slay fest. Yeah, we gotta get going. Woo! I don't know what you're talking about. This reel sounds awesome. Reel sounds terrible. Please, everybody, tell them we need to get it fixed because we don't fix things for years around here. Like our broken I latches. I maintain them so good they don't need to be fixed. Like our broken latches on our boat. What's he got? What's he got? It's a lunker. Feels like a shark. Brian's a shark king. It's just straight Atlantic, Atlantic sharp nose. How's the sound? Does it sound okay? <laughs> you could have done a dozen catch plane cook Atlantic sharp nose. Help. Want help? I guess. Yeah? Okay. We'll flip them in the bow and we'll do hook them. Back at the house, y'all, but first things first, we have a huge announcement and sale just for you watching this video. You guys ask us all the time what sunglasses we're wearing. We wear Revo sunglasses and we're modeling them for you right now. Awesome sale, 30% off all of their frames on their website. All that information will be down below. You gotta use my promo code DARCY30 with a C-I-E at the end to get the 30% off, which is a huge discount. Tons of frames available. In particular, these are the maxi frames in the Spectra color, Spectra lens color, gold frames. They have over nine different lenses to choose from. Brian is wearing Bear Grylls Maverick frames, a collaboration with Revo and Bear Grylls. Yeah, if you got a big head like me, <laughs> these, are, these are for you, okay? Exactly. And uh, the only thing I want to say is a lot of people ask us what lenses, right? Right, what lenses. So go ahead. So for, in general, deep sea, blue water fishing, you're gonna wear blue lenses. For inshore bass fishing, you're gonna wear green lenses. And for your average day of, you know, just doing your average stuff at wherever you go, these are Spectra lenses, Champagne, Terra, again, over nine different lenses to choose from. Yeah, not only fishing, but everything too. Exactly. You know, fashion, whatever. Exactly, so, awesome. exactly. That's why I'm wearing the avi aviators for y'all. Yeah, so, so that, that's a great deal. I and mean, when you see it in a cart, man, 30% off is like a huge, a huge amount. Huge discount. Jump on it, because it's not lasting forever. Everything will be down in the description below. Yeah. And we appreciate it if you buy a pair. Yeah, thank you very much. But uh, you know, back to the fishing, you know, you know, we didn't catch a ton of fish today, like maybe we usually do, but you know, August in, in, uh, in South Florida is the slowest month of the year. Toughest month. Yeah, so you know, we just want to show you guys what's really about it out there. And so if you guys go fishing on your own, you know, you're not gonna have a highlight day like they do in Florida Sportsman or sometimes on a Dar Sizzle show or other shows, you know, you're gonna catch, you know, you catch a keeper mutton, some kingfish, right. uh, you know, bonita and some other fish and you can have a great time out there and, and then get back in before it gets to be 100 degrees out. Right. And uh, that's just the way it is, man. That's that's what fishing is, and that's so right. we're bringing that straight to you today. Right, like we caught a ton of fish, but at the same time, we didn't catch enough for like the fish box, so that might be considered a slower day to most folks. But at the same time, you know, we're just out there following our adventure and living our dream because you're watching. So again, yeah, we so bring just you... keeping it real. Yeah, exactly. Right. Oh, I also want to mention our sizzle. We mentioned the South Current out there. I'm not sure if oh, you guys yeah. know what that means. Is you know, the, the, it always rips north. Right, we have the uh, North Current, which is you know the, the jet stream. Right, all oh, the Gulf Current goes goes north. Okay. And sometimes, by some odd things of winds or whatever, is the little loop might come off and the current will head south, more towards shore typically, okay? And when it hits the bait spot or some other fishing spot where it's the opposite current, you know, the fish just get all screwed up and the water's really dirty and you're yeah. just not gonna have a good fishing day. Yeah. And you literally might wanna just stay home. Yeah. Um, which, you know, but we're out here trying to work and trying to catch fish for you, so, you right. know, we go, right? Right. Because, um, you know, just like charter captains have right. to go fishing whenever the fishing is, whenever they can. So that's just the deal. So just one thing yeah. to look out for, and you can look, on the cams and and you know just see where your boat is drifting when you see that water that dirty water on an outgoing tide coming out the inlet and then going the wrong direction 
you know, you know it's the south side. Right. <laughs> All right. right. Or south current. Right. When right. it goes completely the opposite way of where it's supposed to be going, you know automatically that messes everything up from right, the big right. fish to the big fish to the sharks to the goliaths. So, so. you know, so just a great tip. <laughs> yep. All right, guys. Well, we appreciate you watching this video as always, bringing more epic content to you real soon. Don't forget about the sunglasses. Check it out if you have the chance. We really appreciate it. Yeah. And until our next adventure, follow, follow your, your dreams, dreams and, and keep, keep on catching. catching.